The Santee community is beginning the healing process days after that plane crashed into several homes, killing a UPS driver and the pilot. And while two homes were destroyed, others also felt the impact from that crash. Fox 5's Jamie Chambers is live from the scene where he spoke with neighbors tonight. Jamie. Yeah, a lot of the debris has been cleared out. Fences are up. Things are starting to look a little bit more normal. That being said, people that have houses here are still living through this and trying to process emotionally what they just saw. It's been a long four days since the Santee plane crash jostled the city, leaving a literal hole in the street and a figurative hole in the community. Planes fly over and we still look up. It's a common sentiment for people who were there at the crash. You can't even like describe the feeling like it feels like an old Cold War movie where it's just you hear the, the plane go by and so now it's like every single time you hear an airplane, it's just the worry. Trevor Henton says when the plane hit his neighbor's house, it sounded like a grenade went off in his front yard and now his whole neighborhood is trying to find some peace and space. There were so many flames and it was so big. I couldn't even imagine being the firefighters trying to process it. With the burned out houses fenced and the streets reopened, people from all over the county have been driving by to pay their respects. But those who reside close to the crash site are still living through it. Could have hit that school and then was spread in my house, or it could have been my house in general. And when a plane flies overhead, people are listening closely. It was earlier today and it sounded funny. You know, now, now we think of these things. Dane Pennington personally jumped in to assist his community when their Wi-Fi was cut off by the plane crash. He believes it will take time to heal and feel normal again. I think after a while, you'll, you'll, you'll become numb of it again. But I'll tell you what, this community is awesome. And that really is the sentiment that you're hearing from all the neighbors that walk around here. Two things, some of them say that they're having trouble sleeping, thinking about this over and over, but the other thing is they say they would never leave this community because of the way that the people responded and the closeness they feel to their neighbors. That's the very latest from Santee, Jamie Chambers, Fox 5 News. All right, Jamie, thank you.